Junsi has finally decided to make a new dual output eye charger, and I couldn't be happier with the way that it looks. Now, it's kind of funny that they didn't send a unit over for me to test, like they did with this Prototype X6, and even this Prototype S6 that I had like a year before the thing even really came out for sale. I had to scour the internet just to find info on this thing, and uh, luckily I found some good stuff. We did ask Jun Z for the manuals for these chargers, and they were nice enough to send them over. And yes, there are two different chargers. So I will link the manuals down below in the description so that you can check out all their info and specs. But we will still go over all of the details right here in this video so that you know what to expect with these chargers. Real quick, please take a second to like this video and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out and gives me motivation to keep making good stuff like this. Okay, back to the vid. So there are a few things that we can tell from the pictures online about these chargers. First off, no more jog wheel. This is amazing. I know everybody hated the scroll wheels on the X series and S series chargers. Luckily, it looks like we're done with that. I did notice that there's no tab button like on the iCharger duos, but I think we can live without it. Next up is functionality. We can see from this picture here that we have a regulated power supply mode, just like on the single channel X series chargers. I like this mode for testing electronics on their first power up. Like the X series chargers, the new dual output chargers can also check individual cell capacity, which is awesome for somebody like me who tests batteries regularly. This charger will also check internal resistance just like all the other eye chargers. Taking a close look at the manual, we can see that these chargers support regenerative discharge mode using the second channel, which is awesome because that means you can use an external resistor bank like with the eye charger duos. They won't support a 40 amp discharge load, but 30 amps is pretty good too. And lastly, I'm gonna throw up a bunch of the power specifications so that you can find out if the power supply you already have will work or if you need to get a new one. On the same note, Progressive RC is going to have all of the charge cables and power cables, balance boards, all of the accessories that you'll need to get these chargers up and running. I will leave links in the description for everything that I talked about. Now, Junzi didn't give me a firm ETA of when these chargers will come out, but they did allude to them coming out within the next month or two. So that wraps up my detailed video on these two chargers. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and let me know if there's anything else you'd like to see me talk about in my future videos. Later.